main event. That's what happened. Seconds till we're back, everybody. Tons of energy coming back out of the yes, commercial yes, break. Yes, new day yes. in the ring, and they're waiting oh. on Bobby Lashley and MVP. Coming back in eight, seven, six. Tons of energy coming back out of commercial break. Yes. Three, two, one. Here we go. It is May Let's see that energy out yeah, there. New rock. day. New. Action. Wow, I'm impressed with myself. I'm getting stuff somewhat done. Although I do have to figure out when I'm getting this taken care of. Oh, wait. Hello, folks. Welcome back. For I'm the one, the only. I am a hobo Tom. And let's see here. I'm just getting used to my newish schedule. Because I start training tomorrow for my one job. I'm very happy about I realize I can train for 12 hours. <laughs> 12. Let's see here. Take a look at my four there. That's 16, 20, 32 versus 30. Hopefully 36. 36 plus 20 is 56. I made the right choice. Enough about that. Let's talk about making some important choices. Like K. Hart. Thank you very much, sir. I remember seeing your name here. You know what? You're a master of the air guitar. Cover all. No, no, no. Holy shit. And Gleason wrote, or Gleason RJ, you, sir, are just the master. No, wait. Yeah, you know what, yours, you know what, I'll go back. I don't think you've ever posted before. You, sir, always win twice. That's six count.
monstrous hair. So then, those are all the thank yous. Again, if you want to be a part of that list, get your own little video tribute, yeah, and come find me at this at the Discord group over there at Baked Wrestling. Um, where else? Email, subscribe. I do have one new subscriber. I do not know who that person is. Just shout out, say, hey, I subscribed. Where's my video shout out? Then, I don't know, I wonder if I can do that. Sometimes it tells me. See here, let me see if I can do something quickly. Oh, home de home de ha. Let's see here. Let me go to Gmail. One I very rarely use. See if anyone's subscribed. Make my account more secure. And make your channel from anywhere. And what's security? Who wants to hack me? I have love notes with shorts. The hell? Oh, that's YouTube creators. I don't even care about you. I don't know. Eventually, one day, social. Looking for metalheads. Orchid romance. Whoa. I didn't even know about that. We have the friendliest community. That's hilarious. Oh my goodness. Hot Asian women. Yeah. So let's get let's get to the important stuff. Let's talk about some WWE Raw. This was two weeks removed from WrestleMania. I'll tell you what, this was actually a pretty good show. For some reason, the Raws, nowadays, I, I always want to get the Door of Wrestling in there. I need to get more stuff for that Door of Wrestling. But yeah, eventually it's maybe some baseball tickets. I don't know, maybe I'll have a guest co-host. I do want to have a watch party. Definitely for we have a live stream reactions for Impact the twenty third. Oh yeah, because now I'm not banned anymore. Now my sanctions have been lifted. I can live stream. I just have to be super careful. Although AEW, I don't know. I'll probably pull that with Triple H. They don't care. If they do care. That'd be like the first time in years. They've cared about anything. But yeah. So yeah. So I'm going to be on a little bit more frequently again. Find me there somewhere. Um, so let's talk about WWE Raw. Again. You know. Because I have my Macho Man. The Macho Man shirt. Oh yeah. Like this is my date. Didn't like the fact that I own a purple shirt. Purple shirts are cool man. Don't knock the Macho. Joe King, yeah. Cause she ain't gonna get a kiss on the hand no more. I know that much. Oh yeah, yeah. It starts off with Dominic Mysterio versus Veer. Veer finally makes his in-ring debut. Veer just for the most part manhandles Dominic. Uh, Dominic tried to do uh, a big crossbody. He got caught there. Huge clotheslines. Uh, Veer does a modified choke where it's more like a scissors lock. I, I kind of know what he's going for. He's using, he's doing like a scissors on the neck. It doesn't really affect, they call it a cervical choke, I guess. It's just really a scissors choke. You just put the blade of your forearm into your opponent's neck. Use your other arm to squeeze. Can't do it to myself. It's kind of hard to do that. This is why I need an assistant to do it to me. I, I could walk her through it. Again, ladies, I am single. If you'd like to be this here lonely chair, you can hit me up somewhere. Can, can, can you see said chair? Yeah, see. Well, well yeah. I, I can move a little. Yeah, see. There's, there's no one here. So, yeah. There is that spot. You can fulfill the role of the girlfriend. And trust me, you'd be showered with gifts. For the most part. Especially if I'm earning this pile of money. <laughs> like I am right now. Um, so, yeah. Uh, he put on the cervical choke. A modified choke. I've I've seen it in jiu-jitsu before. Nothing that special. I think I've done it once or twice. 
You literally just put the blade of your forearm into the person's neck, hand behind it. Just, yeah, gable grip. Yeah, gable grip. And you just squeeze like a pair of scissors, like a thing. Yeah. But um, this was a good opening match for Veer. I mean, definitely Dominic's no slouch. Cheeseburger match. Then with the EMTs, they probably got their palms greased a little bit to come out to care of Dominic because Veer just beat him up a little bit more. Good for Veer. Then we have the AJ interview. Um, he sees Damian Priest in the background. It's a brawl. The toss into some empty merch boxes. And this leads us to our next ma match. And, and you'll hear my confusion. And you'll realize what my confusion is about. Uh, it was AJ Styles versus Damian Priest. Uh, it starts off as a brawl. AJ just heavy striking. He's furious with Damian Priest. Priest, again, he has heavy hands and, and kicks and leg kicks. Again, leg kicks are... You go after the... I think it's a sciatic nerve, that, that muscle. There's like one part, it's about three inches above the knee. You start hitting that, you ain't walking right for a while. Uh, AJ comes back, does his shoulder breaker, gets him up. That's great. Priest has a clap, and, a clap thing in the flat liner. Uh, there was no reckoning, uh, reckoning. And this time, AJ hit the Pele kick. Always good to see that. No form. So it was a big kick, and, and then all of a sudden, wait, what's wait, what's going on? Oh yeah, the lights went out. Feel like it happened there. And let's see here. Hopefully it comes back. Yeah. Oh, there we go. It's just a weird delay. But yeah, it was weird. Um. The lights went out, and the match was over. And AJ's like, saying, "What the hell happened?" You know what? This was actually a really good match. But now it's just a ham sandwich of a match. Because it's a dusty ham sandwich. The dusty finish, baby. Nobody wins. I mean, the Miz versus Cody Road. This was also really good to watch. Um, Seth. Seth Rollins shows up ringside. No why. Uh, Cody does a snap body slam just like his brother Dustin Reynolds. So this is Cody Reynolds doing it. Um, Cody, for most part, outsmarts the Miz by getting he fake getting in the ring. Miz went for an elbow drop. He's like, <laughs> I've I've been around too long. I know that trick. Uh, there was a good delayed front suplex. The Miz eventually comes back and master of the chin lock. Get a break. Miz stomps on the fingers. Oh, such a good, such a good underutilized heel move of stomping on the fingers. Um, Cody, again, the safest. Suicide dive ever. Um, and that cell from the basement dropkick was amazing. Miz applied their figure for it, but Cody... Cody, the master of the figure form, Phil. I taught my little about everything I knew. Um, he eventually reverses the pressure on the Miz. Uh, Cody has the, we have the Cody cutter, then the crossroads. The Miz stays down. One, two, three. Good match. Really good show showing for Cody Rhodes for his opening match. Seth Rollins says, "Yeah, good job." And then laughs and gets a rematch. Who knows? Seth is, I don't know. Sleep deprivation was his new baby. Who knows? But this match itself, surf and turf match. And then let's see. So then we get into, and Seth starts laughing and challenges Cody. And Tommaso Champ is in the back. He's like, yeah. This is Ezekiel, Ezekiel. And Kevin Owens shows up. Kevin Owens is just... <laughs> Kevin Owens is so good. Kevin Owens versus Tommaso Ciampa. Oh, that, that is the one thing we never saw in NXT. That would be really good. Then we have Liv Morgan versus Naomi. Uh, first move Naomi did, she just like... 
rubbed her booty into the face of Liv Morgan. Whoa. Uh, Liv tried to cradle. I was like, oh, she, they, they, kicked, they kicked each other in the double kicks. Um, there was no oblivion that, was, that got countered. Naomi hit the power bomb with a prawn clutch. And used to be a move of my princess, Kimberly. Uh, Naomi won. I am sandwich of a match. And we had Bobby Lashley in the MVP lounge. I wanted to see Bobby Lashley just sit on, chill on the couch and just drink champagne from the bottle. He said, you know what? Since I'm here, I'm not going to cut a promo. I'll wait until MVP shows up. I'm going to relax. Sit on the couch and take the bottle of champagne. Chug it. You know he could. Um, again, they cut a promo, so there'll, there'll be a rematch between Bobby Lashley and Omos. It might be the 24th. So they're not going to do anything on Easter Sunday. I doubt that. Yeah, 24th makes sense. Indeed. And then there was Boo Sonya Deville. Another Boo Sonya Deville with Kevin Owens. And Boo Sonya Deville more. Boo. 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 She has all the boos. And Adam Pierce is there. And Kevin Owens, I don't know. He's just boo hoo. Who's this Ezekiel guy? Why are you? And they just seem they just seem not to care. Actually, it's kind of fun watching Kevin Owens go bonkers. When we had Bianca Belair versus Queen Zelina Vega. Um, Zelina Vega tried a quick roll up, but now it's going to happen. Vega tried a modified cattle mutilation. I don't think it was, yeah, it wasn't exactly cattle mutilation. She didn't have the arms, I think. I think she had the neck. But yeah, eventually Bianca Belair got out of that. The fallaway slam, the warrior press, and then the warrior press and drop, and then the KOD, and that was it. Lena Vega, you're done. I mean, it was it was okay. It was it was it was okay. It was what it was. It was short. Ham sandwich. And more Boo Sonya Deville. Boo! Boo! You were supposed to tease Oscar coming out. Boo! Or at least Lacey Evans coming back. Boo! But it said Boo Sonya Deville. It's going to be the next challenger for the women's belt. Boo Sonya Deville. Can't boo her enough. And uh, then there was the bachelorette party on... <laughs> Oh, God. This is just... I want to know who those bimbos were. They weren't enhancement talent, I think. They were paid strippers. Yeah, then Nikki tries to roll up uh, Dana Brooke, who has a very nice side cleavage, by the way. And then R2 says, no, we're not going to have any of the shenanigans until after the wedding. And then we're going to have a double wedding. And to, to me, it just doesn't she's going along with you. she's like hey they're paying me real bears full of money can't hurt and then we had RK Bro versus Alpha Academy Alpha Academy uh, is in charge of the match they jump RK Bro uh, Matt Riddle again he gets beat up a lot uh, he gets splashed by Otis I don't care what they say that has to hurt Rangu gets a hot tag <laughs> when Orton went for the Chaping DDT, literally, you could tell Gable spiked himself. And a little extra stuff. Extra special sauce on that Chaping DDT. Then it was an RKO. RK bro wins. I was entertained. It was quick. Made its point. Cheeseburger match. But no, that wasn't the main event, because I'm like, wait a second, there's like 20 minutes left. And the Usos show up. They say, yeah, we're going to unify the tag team belt. And Street Profits says, eh, eh. We have our match first. So it was Usos versus the Street Profits. 
This sent us home for the night. This was actually really good, too. Iluso is through the double team after J tags in because I think Jimmy got beat up a lot. Uh, again, J, classic heel, cheap shot in the corner. Usos know how to do that. Uh, there was no tag. Dawson got thrown into RK Bro. For again, he just like catapults himself onto the Usos. Usos, that, uh, the one, I'll say J, one of them. Again, that backdrop neck breaker looks so good. Street Profits hit the super blockbuster. However, Ford Frog splashes. Jimmy, and he gets saved by Jay. And Usos did a 3D. Oh, that was pretty cool. Um, so the Usos win. But then you have Randy Orton ringside. Yeah, Randy Orton is getting RKO's to everyone. So that was great. However, Randy Orton then himself ate a super kick party from the Usos. I'll tell you what, this was another fun match. Sets, sets things up pretty well. Surf and turf match. And that was a, a very quick moving Monday Night Raw. Monday Night Raw has been moving along pretty well. So I'm glad, glad to, to see that. It's not a slog anymore. Um... A little bit about this week. So I think I talked about stuff Monday a little bit. So again, this video will go up. So I'm like a day behind. I have my notes here for NXT. Those will go up probably tomorrow. AEW might go live. Because now that I have my new work schedule for... For ETS I work. Which I might make a video f for AEW. And just do Impact Live. No, I might have to make videos for a while. Except for weekends. Because tomorrow I work 11.30 to 3.30 and 10 to 8. Well, I might stretch it out 10 to 10. And just take notes while I'm working. Just be an evil bastard. Um, tomorrow is 11.30 to 8. Pearson... Do you want to get my 12 hours in? Friday's 11.30 to 8. I want to get my another 12 hours in at Pearson there. Yeah, we'll just have to see how things go. Um, for the, but for the most part, on my re regular vi video making schedule. Um, next week... Oh, also, I will be making the Daytona Beach Easter Mania. That will be coming up soon. And that week is going to be just a hectic week. And then Impact Wrestling on Saturday. I might even go fishing Saturday. Then followed by the WWE Sunday. That takes us into, man, the chapter one of Triple Mania. A whole bunch of wrestling coming up. So again, I'd like to thank everyone for watching. Um, maybe I'll just make one big like super prediction video. Next week, too. I don't know. We'll see how I feel. I'd like to thank everyone for watching.